So I had to switch cameras because my iMovie on my iPod is being really glitchy and not saving anything. So I decided to take out my little Kodak, playful, and film on this. This is the flower dog, shall we call it? I think it's supposed to be like a Westie or a Scotty dog or something like this. It looks really nice. And it's directly outside the Guggenheim. There's the Guggenheim. So if it's free, we're gonna go in. And if it's not, I'm going shopping. Oh, there's the colors of the flowers, it's actually pretty nice. I think in summertime, it's a little nicer. We were here when? Last year. Yes. April. April and the flowers were beautiful on that, so. Now, not so much. So yeah, we can actually just check the prices here on these little boards, see whether we want to go in. Yeah. So we're walking around to try and find a restaurant and we came upon the really old church. Hopefully it's not too overexposed and you can actually see a bit of it. Oh, you walk. Okay. Delightful. Gareth's watching his own feet as he walks. So yeah, it's like a beigey colour and like a goldy kind of trim. You'll not be able to see that in the video because of overexposure. What? Crunch. What does it sell? Uh, like a German food, I think. We can have a look at the menu. There was nothing there. Yeah. Oh, you can sort of see a bit of the colour now. I hope. Uh, let me focus on something here and maybe I'll get like, a bit of the colour. Alright, check it. Enough. Yeah. Got a little bit of colour there now. I went over before overexposure killed it. It's actually a really nice church. They seem to be doing some kind of renovation on it. Oh, there you go. Look at that. Would you say a church or a cathedral? What makes a cathedral? They're doing construction. There's a guy, construction dude. Sorry, my dad would kill me for saying dude. Construction fella. And the big steeple. If I'm getting shaky camera, it's because I have to watch where I'm walking. It's being a notorious for people never picking up their dog crap. There's Gary. Oh, art. See, it's art like that I really like. Forget modern art. Give me a nice painted picture any day. That's Ireland. You really think it was, though? You would almost think that's Ireland. Say the North Coast of Spain's very similar. <laughs> Spanish for Gareth. <laughs> Sorry, no. Goes to take a nice picture of this beautiful cathedral and gets my big head in the middle of it all. Oh, better my head than my, than my boobs. <laughs> Shout out for Auntie Doreen's party. Right, so still looking for somewhere to eat. At this point, my stomach thinks my throat's been cut. So I'll vlog again when we find someone. I'm sitting down, relaxing. Might be. We'll check. <laughs> I hope that was caught on camera. This is the uh, roundabout. Stop it! <laughs> Blowing up my camera. This is the roundabout where Mom and Dad and Doreen sat when they came to Bilbao and I got pictures. Um, and there was a young couple across from us, doll in the face of each other. These were appalled. It was disgusting. It was a case of okay, put her down. She needs to breathe sometime. It was really, really bad. We're just walking around. We've got about two hours to kill before we have to go home. So, a bit of shopping. You know, we actually had a lovely meal in a Chinese restaurant. Uh, we wanted the steak, but the steak was gone, so we had to take the chicken. But the chicken was quite nice for a tenner. We had a three-course meal for a tenner. Like, I'm not talking the Ritz Carlton, but it was quite nice. I liked it. Nice. Yes, thank you for reiterating my point. So, Metro. If I see, see anything interesting, I'll let you guys know. I find Sephora. I'm a happy bunny. Yay. So, yeah, Sephora. I was hoping for some like an EOS lip balm. I've seen that on a lot of uh, beauty girls. Gorgeous. Beauty Guru's uh, makeup tutorials. And um, yeah, there's an English one there. There's National Geographic. Okay, new. That's about it. Um, I am just not going to get paid to do this segment of my blog, am I? 
Don't bother. Dear Lord in heaven. Right? Oh, he's like a kid. He's like a two-year-old child at Christmas. I'll ask. No bother. I get a soundtrack. Awesome. We were walking in the street and Gareth noticed a giant baby head. Yes. A giant baby's head. That is freaky beyond belief. Look at that. That's weird. That's not cool. It's looking at us. Huh? Oh my god, it's looking at us. <laughs> yeah, so we're now trying to find the Christmas tree. I know where it is, but I want to go up here first to look at the shop. Okay. So in other words, it's not up in the general area though. This is the main shopping street, by the way. There's a lovely building there. What's that? What kind of building is that? City Hall. It's gorgeous. I wonder can you get inside. It's a really nice building. A lot of the buildings here in Bilbao are really, really old. This is kind of like a follow me about Bilbao video, isn't it? All of my videos are kind of like that. I'm just cool like that, I guess. <laughs> Looking at me weird. Yeah. Ooh, California. Just commenting that this building here looks like something straight out of the dock. And it's right. Uh, red brick buildings are very common. I happen to think it's very beautiful with its architecture. He doesn't like it. He's shaking his head. I'm not allowed to put him on camera so you can't see him shaking his head, but he's shaking his head. Now he's looking disgruntled. Because I've outed him now on YouTube. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, you keep saying sorry to people, they don't understand me. Oh, shoes. This is all we've been doing for the past couple of hours. I love it. Oh, I want an elephant teddy bear so badly. Oh, I haven't, I never had an elephant teddy bear. Never. Saying it loud enough so you can hear. Never had an elephant teddy bear. Let me do that. <laughs> yep, that's yeah. how much hints work. <laughs> That's a nice building. Down here? Yes. Well, I think this is the right way. The Christmas tree, isn't it? I think so. If we don't find it, we don't find it, but I hope we do. Walking up the street, we find this attached to the building. It's like a statue of a Roman woman. Artemis, maybe? I don't know. Or is that Greek? I just made a fool out of myself, never mind. How cool is that? Out of the road, lady. Yeah, so apparently it's the 2nd of July, 1926 of October, October, 1927. Maybe that's when the building was created, this building here. I don't know. Very nice though. He wants me to move now. Still trying to find the Christmas tree. I know what it is, but I still have to find it Okay, he's taking me into all the of, of the uh, industrial parts where there's no shops. I have just left the Court of Inglis not too long ago and I bought part of my best friend's Christmas, pre Christmas present, which I'm pretty sure she's going to love. Yes, shout out to Anya. I don't know if you watch these, but if you do, I got your Christmas present today. So, shy about the shaky camera. Cobbled streets do not make for easy walking. <gasps> I spat on you. Oh my god. No, I'm okay. You couldn't see it anyway, so not too worried. Aha, there is a shop. Aha, your plan is foiled. Ha. Is this like a college or a tech or something? What? Very much so. One last look in. At the people studying. Bye bye. It's a shoe shop and a bag shop. Very nice bag there in the window too. I like it a lot. Mm -hmm. Shoe repairs. 
A lot of the stores here are quite expensive. It's not more expensive than Miranda, because there are some shops where you can get good deals, but um, a lot of them are designer shops. So, unless you're minted, you're not buying anything here. Well, I'm not. Is that for a weird building? Don't mind Mr. Pessimistic beside me. He wouldn't know what optimism is if it bit him in the bum. Anyway, look at that building. So strange. I like walking around cities and seeing new things like this. And not getting killed in the road, it's always a bonus. We're still looking for the Christmas tree. And the adorable man beside me swears blind he knows where it is, so I'm trusting him. And I'm keeping my mouth shut. Look at that. How weird is that? And no, it's not a trick of the light, it actually is poking out like that. So weird. Flying in a V. Really, really bad formation of a V, but a V nonetheless. A V I will take. So, still looking for the tree. Peter getting sore now. Yeah, we've seen it at a distance. Don't have to see it again, but it would be nice. Peter sure. Even kids look at me weird when I'm talking to you. No, not to you. Who would look at me weird when I'm talking to you? I'm at the camera. Yeah, this is like the designer quarter. There's a church down there. There's the Guggenheim. I think we're lost. Okay. So now he thinks it's down this street. I trust him completely, so I'm not saying a word. Fur hat. Disgusting. If you need to kill an animal, make sure you gotta eat it. Not to wear it. Unless you're gonna eat it, then wear it. That's okay. But just for a fashion statement, not cool. Hmm? I get a point. You know, all like the baby seals that are killed for slippers and etc. The person wearing them, think of it this way. If someone came along, whacked your baby in the head and stuck your baby on their feet, you wouldn't be too bloody happy about it either. Think of it that way. We're all somebody's kids. Right, well there's the roundabout. We know that one. Hey, find the Christmas tree. I'll get a close shop shot when we get there. <gasps> Shopping street! Something smells chocolatey. Yeah, something smells really, really good. Really chocolatey. Doggy! Could be Fargy. Fargy, yes. There's chocolate. Yum. Okay. I am going to shop, spend monies. Be happy. Guess what? We find the Christmas tree and it's beautiful. Oh my god. It's massive. I don't think it's a real Christmas tree. Something tells me it's not. But it's gorgeous. We've got loads and loads of lights streaming down from it. Lots of little decorations. Can you see the bows? Can you see that? Bows and different co different coloured baubles on it. And all of different sizes and then around the base they've got hundreds and thousands of these little lights it's gorgeous there's a blue stream of lights as well well worth finding so Gareth didn't know where he was going after all and at the, st at the top is like the star I think it's supposed to be like the star that the kings followed or whatever but yeah and it's situated in this like big plaza so we're just going to sit here for a little while and chill. My feet are killing me. And my back. Really shouldn't have taken a big handbag, but shoulda, woulda, coulda. Yay. It's beautiful. Really puts you in the Christmas spirit. Seriously big escalator. It's like absolutely massive. That's it. Seriously, seriously massive. I think it's taking us a full minute to get to the top and the bottom. Oh, don't 
una cap, em quedo vivit ese. Spanish kids are loud. No, his bag no, come should I tell him? Mm, nope, not gonna tell him. Somebody else will, I'm sure. Now, that took us a full minute. Just to figure out which one goes where. No, he's fucked. <laughs> he's my French. Out. Trains go pretty fast. No, they're fast. We're already at the last hour stop. See? <laughs> That's pretty quick. Let's go. I'm not standing up until this thing stops because I'm not going to fly my face. So we can go home, lie on the couch and do nothing. She's Spanish, I don't want to get killed on the road. Hmm. Be nice, yay. Hmm. Ah, there's smudges on my screen. I'll turn you off and clean you and then bring you back. Waiting on the bus. Should come between 12 and... 15. Any one of these three, four ports? No, three ports. Um, hey, no, four ports. I tried the first time. Any one of these four ports could be our bus. And I'm wrecked. I want to go to bed. Or lie on the couch and do absolutely nothing, watching videos on YouTube. Chill, basically. That's it. That's the extent of what I want to do today. He's nodding in agreement. Walking around Bilbao is tiring. You wouldn't believe how tiring. Where's this guy going? Is he coming in? He is. He is. He's coming in here. And that's Bilbao Burgos. That's our bus. Oh yeah, and we're first in the queue. Delightful. We're now on the bus, and we're going home. So we're in C to. 11, that's me, the window, and 12 is Gareth, he's the aisle seat, because on the way up we got the window and I got the aisle. It is now 3 minutes to 7, so we have 3 minutes to get out of here, um, the bus. I'm tired, I'm going to get out. Just got off the bus and we're greeted by Felice Bentitofe. I hope I said that right. Happy 2012. Yay. It's a bit early, but I like their sentiment. But to walk under here. It's freezing. That fog is still in Miranda. You're going to hear nothing. Oh. Should have bought gloves and a hat. I mean, I've got gloves somewhere in my room. 
but they're brightly coloured festive gloves that oh wait there we go they're brightly coloured gloves and they don't go with everything so oh well I'll make do I've got gloves I don't need to buy gloves should have worn them freezing even see and it's not just because it's night time it's because of that fog still here it was 14 or 15 degrees in Burgos uh, 16. 16 here it's 7 or 6 oh it's freezing cold there's a little light out here Regala una fifta. I have no idea what that means. Oh, buy your presents. That's pretty nice. I like that. Oh, you can buy those. That's cool. Mercadona. They have like the nicest marshmallows I have ever tasted. I'm addicted. Seriously, really cold. Did I say that already? I think I said that already. But I'm gonna say it again. Really, really cold. I'm in Calle Safion with its Christmas lights up. Really pretty, actually. Same Christmas lights last year, but. There's a star. Where? Yeah. Actually. Yes. That's a pretty bright one. Yeah. If you can see it through the fog. Is it a, I think I'm a, a no to light. Uh, it's a, it is. Look, the apartments are right beside it. That's my finger. He says star. I say, oh, maybe it is a star. No, I think still think it's a light. Ha! Told you it was a light. Ha! Anyway, sorry about the shaky camera. Me and Calle Sathion with lovely Christmas lights. Actually puts you really in the festive mood. I wonder if I sing in Jingle Bells. Yeah.